Hi everybody, I am here to show you how to play the new game Wooparoo Land, which is basically Wooparoo Mountain, only it has a different name and you have to start all over because Wooparoo Mountain shut down. Um, it's a little bit complicated, but basically, for those of you that don't know, Wooparoo Mountain was a game that people could play all over the world. And then the company decided to shut the, de the game down in all but like six countries. So if you're not in one of those six countries, you can't find it in the App Store anymore and you can't find it in the Google Play Store anymore unless you somehow trick your phone into having the, um, you know, Japanese or Malaysian or whatever app stores. So, um, and apparently to do that, you have to do some kind of sketchy things, especially for iPhone. So, uh, I'm not going to get into any of that. The way I'm showing you is the easiest way. It's still a little complicated, but it's easier than, you know, jailbreaking your phone and possibly, um, voiding your warranty or having your cell phone company cancel you. So there are a couple things that you need to install first. <clears throat> um, this only will work for Android devices or an Android emulator. Since I have an iPhone, I got an Android emulator called BlueStacks. BlueStacks is free, but they do sometimes pester you a little bit for donations. I went ahead and paid I think it's like $24 for a year because it is freeware and I think it's fair to give people money when they give you free software. So, um, and, and for me, $24, I mean, really for anybody, $24 shouldn't be a ton of money. <coughs> Excuse me. So you go to BlueStacks. It says you can do it on PC or Mac. It's possible that because I have a PC, it only says download for PC. Perhaps if you have a Mac, it automatically detects that you have a Mac. Um, at any rate, you hit this, you download it, you install it, and um, I created a desktop icon for it just because that's how I roll. Be careful when you're installing it. I don't remember if this particular program does it, but a lot of freeware does this. When you install it, make sure you only install BlueStacks because a lot of times with free programs, it'll ask you, you know, do you want this free toolbar? Do you want this free stupid thing that you don't really want? It's usually like a game or a toolbar or supposedly antivirus software. It's usually malware and it's usually really hard to get rid of and it's annoying. So just be careful about that. Whenever you download anything, be careful about that <clears throat> because in essence, you've agreed to have that by downloading it. So, so just be careful to read all the menus before you hit next or before you hit OK. So with that disclaimer, I've already installed it, so I'm not going to install it, like I said. <coughs> Excuse me. Now that you have this, ignore this for the moment because I'm going to explain in a minute. Go to your browser, that comes automatically, and you can go to Toast Games if you want to install the Korean version, um, but we're not doing that right now. That's in another video. What you want to do is find one mobile market. Now, one mobile market is basically, um, it's like the App Store or like Google Play, except it's magical. <laughs> Don't ask me how this works, but you can find apps from any country in this store. So, um, go ahead and download it. This is weird because I already have it.
So here we are on the One Mobile Market. <clears throat> You're just going to search for Whooparoo, and you're going to want to download Line Whooparoo Land. Don't download this because it doesn't work. I will show you later what it does. I already have it, so I'm not going to download it. <clears throat> the other app you need to install is Line. If it will let me type it. The browser can be a little quirky, to say the least. <clears throat> so you go here and you download this and you make an account. And when you're done with that, I'm not going to make an account because I already have one. Um, when you're done with all that, you will have both Line and Whooparoo Land. Um, you should somewhere see these icons and you just click this now the very first time you open it it's going to make you sign in with your line ID that's why you have to have line you can use a guest account but I don't encourage it because once you have a line account you can get more diamonds every day and you can give more diamonds every day so it's better to go ahead and get the line account um, a lot of us, when we first figured out how to do this, didn't sign up for line accounts, and then we found out you could get three extra diamonds a day, and I think if you get to a higher level, you can get up to five extra, but I'm not sure about that. Um, so yeah, you get a whole bunch, well not a whole bunch, <laughs> you get double the diamonds you could get, and um, it's definitely worth it to have the line account. I don't, I don't ever use the line account for anything. You can use it, but I don't. <coughs> Excuse me. And right now, this is the summoning event that they have that I am not having good luck with. Oh, I get a present. What do I get? Oh. I mean, I like diamonds and all, but there's other stuff I'd rather have. I was hoping I'd get a cauldron ticket. So anyway, here it is. And this is basically just like the old Whooparoo Mountain was. Um, there aren't, I don't think there are any new Whooparoos except for these three which are the and my melody and pum pum pudding these you have to get through the cauldron which is difficult because it costs a crap load of gems to do that because sometimes you can win cauldron tickets but you usually get like all this other crap like I have about 10 of these <clears throat> so anyway that's how you play Whooparoo Land and I hope that you enjoy it oh I did say I was gonna do this <coughs> by the way this is not Whooparoo Land this is um, it's for the Korean version and it shows you different combinations to make different creatures, but since there are a whole bunch of different creatures in the Korean version, I'm not going to go over it. I found this still in the Mobile One Market, but it doesn't work. I tried, um, I, I can show you what it does. I tried, and... It will load, it acts like it's loading, and then it wants you to log in. I'm not going to do that because the way this is set up, it's an Android emulator, and you'll be able to see my password, and I don't want you to see my password, but 
even if you try with a guest account, it'll just tell you that you can't log in. So I don't really know why it is even in the store still. <coughs> So there you go. Actually, it's not doing the login thing. I guess because I, I tried to log in before. So anyway, I hope everybody has fun playing the new Wooparoo Land. And if you aren't in Asia, now you can play it.